This math book has a new game plus. You probably recognize it, Larson's Algebra 1. This happens to be the Common Core edition, so I think it has a couple things cut out that you would have seen in the original version, I'm not sure. But it does have New Game Plus, just like the original version, so have no fear. This book and Larson's Algebra 2, which maybe you've also seen, this guy's a monster. Uh, this guy also has New Game Plus, we'll look at that too. Larson's Geometry textbook, I assume also has New Game Plus, but I don't own it, so I can't tell you whether or not it does. I do have a digital copy of Larson's Calculus, which I'm sad to report does not have New Game Plus. If you're familiar with these books, you know they have buckets and buckets of content. When you get to the end of any chapter, like here's chapter four, you get to the end of this bad boy, and what happens? You get a chapter summary with big ideas, you get chapter review with vocab, and then you get review examples and exercises, and then they hit you with the chapter test, bam, chapter test, right after that, boom, more test. This is test prep, short response practice, applying the scoring rubric. You see like how your stuff would be scored. Multiple choice, gridded answers, extended response. Bam, new chapter. This is a behemoth. But you get all the way to the end of the book. You think it's over, right? What's at the end of the book? I got selected answers probably, got the index. Oh no, baby, you got the post game. That's what you've got at the end of this bad boy. Look at this, skills review handbook. Okay, so here you got like a recap. Here's all the things you're supposed to learn. Here's a bunch more examples, cause why not? But then you get to the blue section. Is <laughs> there you go. New game plus, buddy. Look at that, you thought you were done? You thought you did all the practice and all the problems you needed to? Fat chance, welcome back to chapter one. You're 900 pages in, but your journey has just begun. It's time to go through it all again. And look at this, it's not just a smorgasbord of chapter one content, it's ordered. 1.1, 1.2, 1.3, right? If you see any problem here and you got no idea what's going on, you know exactly what chapter and section to go back to. Everything's ordered, everything's labeled, and of of course, you have this extra practice for every single chapter. Five, six, seven, eight, do the whole thing again. Why not? It's New Game Plus. Look at that. It's incredible. And like I said, it's not just Algebra 1, but also Larson's Algebra 2. This is the non-Common Core edition, just your standard Larson Algebra 2 gigantic brick of a book. And it's got all sorts of good stuff in it. It's laid out just like Larson's Algebra 1. There's a great cohesion to these things. And if you flip to the back of this guy, Oh, all this stuff, graph and write equations, the circles, all this good stuff. But when you get to the back, what do we got? What do we got? We got the skills review handbook again, right? Skills review handbook, go over everything. Some more examples, more exercises. You think it's to wrap up. It's not to wrap up. Nuh uh. This isn't to wrap up. This is to prepare you for New Game Plus. Bam, look at that, extra practice. You want more practice? Here's a thousand more problems. How's that sound? Look at that, chapter one, chapter two. They got extra practice for everything. Function, domain, range, chapter three, chapter four. Just do it all again, hundreds more problems. You know, a lot of people criticize these books. They think like, man, the authors, the publishers, they just make these massive textbooks because that's how you make money. You need the textbook to be massive. You know, it's ridiculous, it's silly. Uh, but a couple things, right? One, you can get these dirt cheap on eBay, okay? Nobody wants them. Because um, I don't know, people are weird. They like don't collect math books. But um, secondly, it's not like this is stuffed with gobbledygook, okay? It's not gobbledygook, it's stuffed with resources. Tons and tons of resources, tests in every chapter, thousands of problems. If you're taking one of these classes and you're struggling and you want more practice, you want more explanations, look at the book. Look at the book. How, how much practice? H how many examples? Try, it. I don't know, a thousand pages, is that enough? You have so many examples gone over in the text, in the body of the text, right? Main body of the text, you got tons of examples. And then at the end of each chapter, tons of examples, walked through. You got vocab review, you got so much. And then at the end, just go over everything again. At the end of the book, go over everything again. Go over everything again, why not? And then you got your new game plus. I mean, come on, this is just crazy. So that's it. I just wanted to show you these cool math books and their new game plus. I've never seen a math book with new game plus, but these guys, they've got it. It's incredible. Everything you could want and more. See ya.